February 2019, week two. Speak with Todd Mullen at the production area. Speak with Todd Mullen at the production area. Jesus Christ. Ooh, hello, Alexa Bliss. Hello, hello. You look tired there. May I recommend a coffee or maybe two? As soon as you close an eye, especially in the living, someone will take you down. Stay up, stay woke. Hey, if you're offering for coffee, I don't mind having coffee with you, Alexa Bliss. Uh huh? No? Maybe later. Is it because I'm blue? I look blue. Alexa Bliss. Swoon! So anyway, we've got uh, that Renee Young over there, probably vocal exercising because she's talking to herself. But oh, oh Emma, oh uh, not because she's not with the company anymore. Have we got an office? Oh no, that's the locker room. All right, Todd Mullen, what up? <coughs> <coughs> Mind if I ask you a personal question? Depends. How personal? How do you feel about giving interviews? Hmm. I find I have, I have script, nothing in school. I love being on camera. What can I say other than I love being in front of a camera? Natural movie star, ain't ya? I don't know about that, but there's something thrilling. About the attention. Then there's some good news headed your way. Have you met Renee yet? Plays it straight, had questions at times, but a good interviewer. Told me she wants to ask about ask you about what went down last week. It's no big thing. You'll like her. Say what you mean and have fun with it. <clears throat> Okie dokie. Man, man out. Oh, he's doing a smirky face now. Man, everyone I speak to is the production area always has a smirky face. I need to go over and speak to Renee Young and get interviewed about what I did to Cesaro and that was I bet the crap out of him. Yes. There's only one superhero around here and his name is Man Man. Let's talk about the attack last week at the young match. What was to do with that? Why did you do it? I'm here to make an impact. I'm not waiting for my turn. During an interview, when a young asks you a question, your answer is entirely up to you. If I had a choice, I would actually say what I mean and not what it says up there. But uh, the stronger your interview response, the more popularity or influence you will earn. I'm here to make an impact. If there's one thing I came here for, it's to make an impact that everyone will remember. Sometimes it's not enough to wait to eat in the rain. The universe has to understand something clearly. I'm here to change things. That might be in rather the... Jesus Christ, man. I knew he was going to do that. Interviews can be interrupted. If another WC was to interrupt your interview, you'll get a chance to respond with a rebuttal. The tone of your rebuttal determines if you gain popularity or influence. There's a place for you. But it's far below me in the parking order. Picking order, based on your pathetic technique, it's probably at the very bottom, actually. I did it before I pressed the X, so it doesn't disappear on me like the last time. Anyway, Cesaro, the real reason is I am the only superhero around here, not you, Mr. Swiss Superman. I am Man Man. Yes? Hmm, <clears throat> you know what you sound like? A loser hiding his true identity with flashy, shallow aggression. Stay out of my way from now on. Looks like you want to have a smack. That's right. Oh, man, man. It's looking more and more like you want to have a smack. Maybe this time. It'll leave an impression. On that what skin you call a face. Ho, ho. Those fucking words. <clears throat> and Renee Young said something, but it didn't actually say on the subs at the bottom. Probably back to you, Michael Cole. Oh, I unlocked Company Man Level 2. <clears throat> Speak with Todd Mullen at the production area. Again with the Todd Mullen guy. Something about him. He irks me. He is very irkable. He reminds me of that uh, Blade guy, Baron Blade. I want to punch him in the face. Hello, Todd Mullen. 
Nice first time interview. What? That's it? You want an award for best actor in the leading role? I think your performance will go over well with the WWE Universe. For now, you've got a match. Dream about your big screen debut once you've laid the SmackDown. Now, get out there! Oh man. <laughs> Thanks, man. Give me a kiss. Got weird. And the fireworks are going off again for another week on Raw on a Monday. And this is February and I'm still pissed off that I missed the Royal Rumble. Anyone else? I'm a little angry. A little angry, but I'm fine. WrestleMania's around the corner and we are live in Washington DC, the nation's capital. And skip. Ooh. My man, this is Cesaro's tonight. I thought it would be for, it's a pay-per-view, but it's not. We got Man Man, we've got uh, the Swiss Superman man. Going at it tonight, it's superhero versus uh, technically superhero. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I mean. And the blue guy, and that guy, who's not me, it's the bald guy. The bald guy versus the, the, the blue guy. Blue bald. Mask? No mask. Super. And we are live in Washington DC tonight. I am Mike McCoy, the big dog, the big dog, the big dog. And we are live in Washington DC. Look, this is not the big dog. This is the man man. Where's the big dog? He's not the big dog. Big dog, big dog, the big dog. No, it's not the big dog. It's Cesaro. Where's the big dog? Oh, look at Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns. Do I sound like Michael Cole? Ruby Reigns! I stopped watching Raw a long time ago. Mmm, clothesline by Seamus. The Swiss Superman is hurting me. Oh, take that boot. And then Hurricane Runner. And a, oh, little axe handle there. To his dumb bald head. Take that nut. Kick to the stomach. And splats. I splatted his face to the ground. And it's sent on. Missed. And now my back hurts. Oh, no you don't. You missed. Uh-oh. On the floor. Uh-oh. He reversed it. Oh. And now I have that minus. Which means I'm not going to be able to reverse anything that he's going to do to me. And I'm now dead. Ouch. This is going to hurt. Maybe not. Ooh. I tripped. Oh. None. Cesaro. He's tough when he attacks me from behind. At least I did it in the front. But he just stood there. Just saying. What are you clapping at? My back. My spine. Hurts. Ouch. I was not expecting that. Are you okay? Excuse me, little burp there. I'm going to kill him. Are you deserve it? Just a spot of the fly. I'm going to kill him. Oh sure, I thought I'd kill him. Profane his remains. <clears throat> Easy now. We already have one Undertaker. He he he. Ho ho ho. And he's not taking a princess. <laughs> Alright, you watch your ass, you hear? Man, you are one with jokes. Aren't you, Mr. Todd Mullen? Mullen? Anyway, where's the Zaro? Where is he? Where is he? Exit arena by talking to the parking lot attendant. Again. There's a bald guy. Hit him. Hit him. Oh, no. Wait. That bald guy's got a suit. We've got uh, Bray Wyatt. There is uh, Bray. And there's a guy with a uh, helmet over there. And a woman person over there. And this guy over here. Where did Nia Jax come from? Was she always there? Are you ready to head out? I can grab you your scar. It's a spaceship man. Yes, I'm done for the day. Yep. How's the kids? Oh, they're fine, you know, just doing the things. They can walk now. Because they walk to college every day. I miss them. Oh, it's week three in February. It's 2019 again, and I have to speak with Todd Mullen again. Anyone around here? Oh, it's Curtis Axel. Oh, Alexa Bliss again. Hello. So, about that coffee you mentioned. 
Still talking about coffee. I wouldn't mind sitting against across the table with you. And then on the table with you. <clears throat> Excuse me, what? Nothing? So, let's go speak with Todd Mullen at the production area. Nothing over there. And a security guy over there. And I'm guessing there's another one over there. Uh, are they chanting RKO or am I going deaf? Oh, weird. Hello, Todd Mullen. You stupid idiot. Hello. Hello, Paul Gallup. I can't let you go out there. What's going on? Mick says it might be best if you don't have a mask tonight. After the reason's unpleasantness. You know. Don't run in. You can't do that, but I was victim. What's up with my mind about this? Yeah, I'll go above your head. I'm going to eat to Mr. McMartin and talk to him. The hell you will. The hell you will. Oh my god, his voice changed. <clears throat> you think you can just waltz right into this office on your whim like that? Oh, Mr. McMahon, sir, all you respect with my panties are ruffled up in a boot. Stop! Will you help me? Whoa! <laughs> I have a legitimate grievance, man. Dude! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm weird. If you had the back of the entire universe, you would never advise you to do that! I don't know why that is. <laughs> that might exist in the rest of the <laughs> Okay, just because you're full of hot air right now, don't give you a right to visit. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with me, I'm weird. And you know, it wasn't just Mick I heard from Vince about this too. He said you ended up looking worthless. On the statement of the season, he wasn't happy. As it is, he doesn't think you can be a dominant superstar. Great! So I'll cool my heels and sit around doing nothing then, and while you are acting weird. Don't know what to tell you, but you need to change things up a bit. Well, at least just calm down. <laughs> Oh man, that just got weird real fast. And he's now smirking like an idiot because he's an idiot. Now I need to find an ambush Cesaro before I just completely pass out from stupidity and laughing at my stupidity. Oh. I'm a stupid person. Anyway, I amuse myself. I don't worry about that. Where's Cesaro? Hey. I said, I've seen a bald guy around here. Hello? The guy, the guy goes by the name Cesaro. That's not him. Uh, there's a locker room behind me. I should probably go and check in there. Oh, there's Dana Brooke. And uh, Neville and Tyson O'Neill over there. Cesaro, not eating. Cesaro, doesn't seem like what kind of person to eat. So I'm going to have to go into the locker room now. And uh, check in there. And if not in there, maybe she's in that office. Wouldn't want to go and brawl in that office now, would we? A locker room. Open the door. <gasps> there he is. And there's a character's hour. Hello. I'm going to ambush you now. Take this. <laughs> oh, yes. And a character's hour runs away and knocks over a chair. <laughs> That's it. Stay down. Stay down! You attacked me last week because I attacked you the week before. Well, I attacked you this week. 